hello everyone welcome to my channel please enjoy watching this nail art video if you're new to my channel please hit like if you're returning viewers thank you so much for today's video i will recreate one of my first nail art video that i made two years ago um, this is my first christmas nail set here's the video clip on how i did this old set back then it wasn't good i know it looks terrible until now I'm still practicing I know there's still a lot to improve I'm far from perfection I'm also still improving the quality of my video I want this old set to look much better so I will do some few changes and add some new elements in this but definitely I will still use all the nail products that I use in this old set so let's see how far I improved from two years ago In my previous nail set, I used red gel polish and I painted my five finger nails with it and so I'm still using that but instead of painting it all with just red, I will be using another gel color so I apply red gel polish for my thumb, index and ring finger nails and for my middle and pinky nails, I apply this natural color from Kani and I apply two coats each. I will apply these holographic glitters on my index nail. On my old set, I did not use this. As I said previously, I will do some few changes and adding some new products in this. This will be like a recreated enhanced version of it. I want to achieve a candy cane vibes here. Um, I draw some thin and thick lines and I also painted some Christmas holly to incorporate in this design. I use a red and green gel polish. And for the middle nail, I just draw a vertical and horizontal lines and add a red ribbon to make it look like a Christmas present. For the next design, I will be doing the sweater nail art. Originally, I did this on my index fingernails. What I did is I mixed the red gel polish and acrylic powder already before I apply it on my nails. As you can see on the top of the corner of the screen. And this time, I will be doing this on my ring finger. I apply my top coat first and cure it for 60 seconds. And then I outline the sweater pattern first and I pour the red acrylic powder on the top of the uncured gel polish and cure it for 60 seconds.
And for the pinky, I will be doing the same design that I made from the previous nail set. I want to achieve back then is a 3D candy cane pattern inspired and it turned out a disaster. I have a lot of error when I did this design. I did not put matte top coat first before I did the 3D line. So when I apply the chrome powder, it cover all over the nail that's supposed to be only on the 3D lines. So now I will do this as neat as possible. I also apply matte top coat first and then cure for 60 seconds. And I do a thin diagonal lines with builder gel and cure it for 60 seconds. And I wipe off the sticky layer of the builder gel. And then I apply glossy top coat only on the 3D lines. So the gold chrome powder will stick perfectly on the 3D lines. And I also add diagonal lines using a red gel polish. Here is the glitter that I used from my old set. I will still use this but this time I apply this only on my thumb fingernail. I mix this with builder gel and I apply just a thin layer. On my previous set, I did the hanging Christmas ornaments and I used star glitters for the ornaments. But this time, I want to change the design, just a little changes. It's just one big Christmas ball on the center of the nail. I first draw a X mark so I can make a perfect circle and I will fill in the circle with crystals and pearls. I'm also adding some pixie crystal to fill in the gaps and I will also add gold caviar beads for the surrounding of the Christmas ball. And I also add this ribbon and silver caviar beads for the added look. And now I finish this design with a glossy top coat except for the ring finger nail. And here is the finished look. I really like the outcome and I love the design. And I would like to say thank you for watching. I know it's too much to ask. Please support my channel by clicking the subscribe button and I will surely highly appreciate that. Thank you so much. See you on my next video. Bye!